It never ceases to amaze me how more efficient the machining process can become by simply implementing software technology. If you'd like to become even more efficient within your machine shop, why not speak to the team at Siemens? So the objective were to help RJ to get better visibility of their processes and of their uh, machine's performance and also uh, to extract more performance and to uh, optimize their machining if possible. So I, I guess we need to measure it to see where we are before we can improve things, don't we? Yes, we did. So we use Manage My Machine, uh, which is a cloud-based uh, application based on Mansphere, to monitor and to record and to give visibility of all the aspects of the production of the shop floor. Mm -hmm. And then we decided to be even bolder. And you know, even if RJ is very good in optimizing and in uh, leveraging all the performance of their machines, we try to use uh, the adaptive control application from Siemens uh, to, the, um, to cut cycle time. Mm -hmm. And this was a challenge because uh, RJ is already mastering you know, the um, productivity of their machine and they are optimizing very well their processes. Mm -hmm. But we realized that just with this software you know, that measures the torque of the spindle and adjusts the feed rate, uh, uh, we were able to gain uh, uh, significant time uh, into this specific uh, kind of um, uh, piece. And today we're stood in front of this brand new Helen machine, aren't we? You know, it's obviously a, a modern control, modern machine. How about the thousands, tens of thousands of Siemens controls out there in the field that aren't so new? But most of the Siemens controllers are supported, also the older ones. And also for um, other controllers, you know, we have hardware that you can add to be able to achieve the, single, the, the same performance. So call Siemens, uh, you know, we'll work on that. We'll try to be a consultant, as we did in an RJ, to find uh, uh, if we make this uh, uh, achievement also in your, in your, in your company. And speaking to RJ, the return on investment wasn't long at all, was it? No, it was not. The, yes, the return on investment is very um, short, uh, usually from three to nine months. In, in RJ, we were on the higher side of this because of their ability to optimize already their, their processes. So the main challenges with RJ were you know, to understand uh, how they work, their processes, and how to help them to improve with our products. Uh, the second one was to achieve better performance in a company that is already well known you know for being very efficient and very um, productive and the third one you know was to do some training to rj staff so they are more and more independent so they they can use these tools without relying on siemens personnel our relationship with siemens is very long in fact we have uh, most of our machineries have siemens control since a few years so we had to digitalize our production so that the, to ensure that analysis were done automatically and no more manually. Uh, more than this, we wanted to have a real-time overview of the company and of the production, so we could uh, act immediately on production to make changes and to solve the problems uh, as soon as they happen. Mm -hmm. um, in the last years, we also wanted to uh, add a customize, uh, some customized KPI and uh, some uh, automatic alerts uh, that comes out from the production. And for this reason, we found a good uh, solution with Siemens for reaching this result. Mm -hmm. So if we look at the shop floor monitoring software, um, measuring it is one thing, but presumably you measure it and then you, you look to improve efficiency. Yeah, measuring is the first thing. Uh, we need to collect uh, first data that uh, we can uh, analyze then and uh, we can act immediately on, uh, on this data. For this reason we need the exact, exact data that comes out from the production and after we can uh, analyze better what's going on. So we can understand immediately if one machine uh, is not working or there's some problem on it. Uh, we can analyze the batches uh, in the machineries. We can analyze uh, if our um, if our fixture has some problems, or we have anything to, to can, we can uh, act on that. So uh, it was very important for us to have this cooperation, and we used Manage My Machine because it we thought it's a good software for us for mm. uh, for reaching these results. And uh, then, uh, once we had reached uh, this uh, data, we wanted to improve our production by increasing the efficiency of the machineries. We wanted to reduce cycle time 
for what possible because uh, cycles were already very optimized. So it was uh, such a challenge for us and for uh, also Siemens to, to try to reduce this. Mm -hmm. But we gained good results with the active control software. We could reduce around 10% the cycle time. And for this reason, we think we are going to extend all these results also to our other facilities, one in Brazil and one in the US. And just finally, in the global environment, remaining competitive, is, it's, it's getting more and more important, isn't it? Yeah. So companies like you, you have to keep investing in technology, you keep, up, you keep using software to become more efficient. This is getting even more important, isn't it? Yeah, for sure. Sustainability is, has always been also a very important uh, task for us. Uh, in the last uh, years, we implemented uh, the solar panels on our roofs. And so we are trying to better use energy and the resources we use uh, in normal uh, production time. Uh, more than this, we reuse the water that we have in our machineries. We increase the life tool of the cutting tools and we better understood when was the right time to change the toolings. So also this, uh, if we could do it every, with every machinery, that would be a great goal for our sustainability task. So adaptive control, more efficient, better cycle times, reduced cutting tools, better for the environment. Perfect. Yeah, it's perfect for our reality and I think we could extend it also integrating with our management system of uh, our other companies uh, around uh, in uh, Brazil and US.